actually received three grants last year. I received two grants, one for costuming and one for a wireless microphone sound system. Last year we built this costume and we've made many costumes using our, I think we got five sewing machines, five sewing tables, all kinds of supplies. Um, this is Elsa, if you haven't seen the movie 400 times. Um, we got a dress that was about a size, I want to say it was like 20 or 22. My kids altered it, we added the beading, we, we made this cape, um, we, they absolutely love it. And we were able to do a musical last year using our wireless microphones. This is one of ten, and I have everything else to control it. This year we're actually going to be doing High School Musical with it in two weeks. We're very, very excited. This year, um, as it says right here, we got stuff to do a dressing room. I got a four sets of vanities. We use them when we're getting dressed for shows. We use them in class to learn about makeup. And I got two partitions, one for in our dressing area so we can change into our costumes, and one for backstage whenever we need to do quick changes. And our school was brand new. We didn't have anything in our theater program. And thanks to the Educa Education Foundation, we can do musicals. We, have, we can learn about makeup. We can make our own costumes. We're saving a lot of money having a lot of fun. This is all about that space and all the instruments in the sand and the mallets that you see here were provided by the Education Foundation and these are the bass sounds of the instruments and ensembles that we play. It fills up the lower sound like a bass guitar in a rock band, that sort of thing. So as the kids come in they just wail on it, they're sturdy. And every kid in our, in our school plays on it. We use it again for our after school ensemble. This is our metallic phone. So we, we had some things at our school, but just not the complete ensemble and the complete package. So our Education Foundation grant provided all of them. This grant from the Education Foundation is all about the Spartans in space. And I had two aerospace classes design a high altitude balloon project. It's going to carry several things in a payload up to uh, about 115,000 feet. And uh, when the balloon pops, in tow is going to be a, uh, a paper airplane that, that the kids have competed or, or have applied for a Guinness Book of World Records to release the highest altitude paper airplane. Um, currently, the record is about 109,000 feet, and if we break it with 115,000 feet, I'll have 24 students who hold a Guinness Book of World Records. So that, this, this is designed to be released when the balloon pops. And when the balloon pops uh, with our physics teacher in, co in combination with our students had designed, uh, that's George Dowdy had designed a, an Arduino system that's got a gyroscoping accelerometer. It's going to register that we're in free fall and it's going to activate this servo. And this servo is going to release a peg that the balloon is tethered to. So when this, when this peg is released, the balloon falls, and if everything goes to plan and we can get it back on the ground safely, then uh, we'll have broke, broke the Guinness Book of World Records. So all 800 of the students at Ben's Branch Elementary painted on canvas while they came to art class. It took about three art classes to complete. Each grade level focused on an artist. We learned about them and then were inspired by them to create our work. The grant provided all of the money for the brushes, the paint, the canvases, and the easels.